So what's going on guys, my name is Mr. Dalek JD and welcome to a very special video and yes in this video you are going to see a zombies easter egg completed on round 200. I know what you're thinking and I agree with you, it shouldn't be possible to complete a zombies easter egg on round 200. But with the recently discovered freeze mode easter egg on target the Toten, you can get to round 200 pretty quickly and I've always wondered what would happen if you completed the easter egg with freeze mode activated to take you to round 200 and I've answered it for you guys and you're definitely gonna be surprised so be sure to watch the video all the way through to the end i've spent about eight hours or so trying to make this video because you'd be surprised at how many steps before the ending can just break entirely when you go to round 200 if you enjoy zombies videos and you want to see more like this then be sure to subscribe to the channel it felt super good to be uploading fresh target totem in 2020 if you want to see more wacky challenges like this then comment your ideas below and be sure to leave a like rating if you want but let's do this so you know the drill, ladies and gentlemen. We have our chill out button ready, and we're going to see if we can complete Targ's Easter egg on round 200. Now we are on the final step. We are just about to do the bubble step, and I'm very nervous, but should be a very fun completion. And then straight after that, we'll be able to go to round 200 and see what happens at the end. Do we have zombies spawning in? Do we have anything? That's what I want to know. I don't know if it was emphasized enough at all in the video's intro, but I've literally spent about three hours or so trying to get here. I've just had the worst luck imaginable. As you can see, I've only got one uh, <laughs> quick revive left. And it also took me about 50 box spins to get the heli on Salvo. So thank God we got it. All right, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. This is a much higher round than I'd feel comfortable with. Because it's this point where the Wonder Waffa is pretty useless. Might have to dip out the bubble just for a moment to run back into the bubble. All right, perfect timing here. Oh my God. Oh! Yo, if that did not happen then, I don't know what would have. Good Lord, that was close. And here is the moment where boys become men, ladies and gentlemen. This is it. Oh, and there we go. We're getting the beautiful music. Oh, you got to love it. Just going to pop this as well. Temporal gift. So then, like, you know, if anything does happen, I can pop the... Uh, well, I can't even pop the insta kills. Great. Maybe I needed to pop the insta first. So this, these elixirs might actually be pointless for us. But we should be all right. All right, this is always the nerve-wracking bit. So nerve-wracking. Okay, can we do this even without our special? Nah, I'm just going to do it. <laughs> I'm just going to do it. Boys and girls, this is looking like we're going to do it. Oh, yes. <laughs> We've done it. All right, let's claim the Agarthen device. And oh, you can just tell that something's different with the map. This is where we see it completely lavified. It's gorgeous. I really hope that... You know, leading forwards, we get more maps that have dynamic changes like this. Now, there's one thing I need to do before we can go to round 200, and I need to give Pablo the Agarthen device. Now, you'd be shocked, right? But I've actually attempted this video before. I wasted about two hours doing everything, setting it up, recording it, and then going to round 200 before giving him the device and uh, it glitched him out and I couldn't finish the map. So couldn't finish the Easter egg. So I'm very interested to see what happens this time round. Okay, this is what you've all been waiting for, boys. Threes mode, round 200. What happens? Here we go. Hold to chill out. Okay, we've activated freeze mode now. So it should skip us to round 200. Let's just see. Oh, yeah, that's definitely working. All right, so it's put us on round 200. As you can see, we're in the spawn room. We got that freeze mode Easter egg going on, and we can't leave. But you're probably wondering, how am I going to complete this Easter egg? Well, we can escape. Now, the one weird thing that freeze mode lets you do <laughs> when you get to this last bit of the Easter egg is you can survive all lava. Because if I just start running through it, look at that. That is wild. Like, imagine if you could do this in transit. This would be a life-saving, game-changing moment for all gamers. But as you can see, I can just, you know, casually stand in as much of this lava as I want, and we will never die. And I think it is because of the freeze mode that we can do this. So let's see, can we, like, swim under back here? Doesn't look like we can, which is a shame, but... Still really cool nonetheless, so let's go do a little bit of exploring. I was really hoping that a zombie would spawn, 
or any sort of zombies, but it doesn't look like they have. So you're probably thinking, how the heck am I going to complete this Easter egg if I'm trapped in here? Well, Treyarch don't want to let you know this, but at the moment, if you jump and crouch, um, you can just sneak right through and you're out. But I didn't tell you that. Okay, look, see, completely solid, but we're out. And you can see if we don't move, we are going to freeze. So that's going to be awkward, but we've got an ice slide. I wonder what a lava slide would be. Let's take a look, shall we? Oh my god, this <laughs> this is so weird. No damage. Uh, can't swim under there. Oh my god. <laughs> it's like walking through ice. That's very odd. I guess they never intended us to even be able to get this far. But how wild is this? Being able to just run through lava like it's nothing. You can check out so many parts of the map you couldn't before. I, I can't tell. All right. I thought there was a wall by back there that disappeared, but... Nope, we've got the wall by right there. We can walk all the way through the lagoon and the sunken path as well, like as if it's nothing. It's crazy. And there are still snowballs about as well to pick up, which I think is pretty cool. Um, this is what the artifact storage room looks like. It's a bit bit different, you know, no barrel. It's all kind of changed. I didn't even notice the perk machines get put on fire. That's a really cool detail that I never noticed before. That is awesome. Got the cargo hold here as well with this infamous lava. And I'm pretty sure if we drop down from a... Oh my god. Drop down from the uh, zip line, we wouldn't take any damage in here, which is crazy cool. Hidden path again. We're completely invincible. I don't know how we're doing this. I don't know how this works, but it just does. Being in freeze mode, let's do this in the beach. Like this is the pure test right here on uh, taking damage. And let's see, can I freeze inside of lava? Oh my god, we can as well. This is such a weird thing. How on earth do you freeze? How on earth do you freeze like that? In lava, it just doesn't make sense, does it? It really don't. I was really hoping that we might get like a zombie to spawn in or something like that during this. Can we even start doing challenges? No, we can hold the start, but it's not gonna let us do anything. I'm really intrigued to see if we can actually catapult to like the secret place and swim through it. Would that even work? Oh man, zipline handle required for use. We can't even go back to the facility once we're at this step in the egg. I don't know if that's because, uh, you know, we've just, we're finished or because our guy is gone. Um, technically that means, you know, there is no more zipline handle. I don't really get it. That is a bit of a shame, but let's go ahead and uh, activate the egg, get that cutscene, and then see if it says that we survived 200 rounds and completed the egg, because that'd be kind of cool. Well, there's quite a few death barriers that are happening at complete random, which uh, is a bit weird. Moment of truth. Can we complete the egg on round 200 with freeze mode? Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Will it work? What? What the hell? Are you... Whoa, what the heck? We picked it up and it just took ages for the cutscene. I thought it was going to glitch out then. You can hear me freezing as well. Comrades, that is wild. Oh man, this is hitting me in the feels. Every time this ending is still so, so emotional. Now here's the question. Are we going to get that second cutscene? Or is the game going to glitch? Here we go. No way. What? <laughs> we are frozen. <gasps> Wow, that's so cool. And I can't unfreeze. That is weird. Clicking the melee button doesn't get rid of the freeze on the screen, but it doesn't matter. As long as I move the stick on the left, Samantha and Eddie are going to start walking. But that is so weird. In game, we've been frozen for like a good, probably 15 minutes at this point. Oh, here we go, boys. Here we go. Oh, Dempsey, don't. Here we go, boys and girls. The finale of zombies frozen with freeze mode. Now, what will it say? Will it say we survived 200 rounds? Oh, 199 rounds. <laughs> Oh man. Oh, but it still says 200 on the side there, on the left. 
but at least we're not frozen. That was wild. What a wild ride, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it somewhat entertaining and useful, so you can definitely not do this yourself at any point. That's three hours of my life I'll never get back, but if you did enjoy the video, be sure to drop a like rating, subscribe for more zombies, and I'll catch you for another video very, very soon.